All right, so as you guys can see, we're outside. There's still snow, um, but it's pretty good weather actually right now. And I, I think this is the last time it snows, so it should just start full on spring and summer. And we'll be able to do some herping, but this is gonna be more of a unique video. We have this package here. Uh, you can use my knife from Walmart that I use to open boxes all the time. Um, and my family and I, we, we just ordered one of these. We had ordered one a while ago. Um, but, or like a few years ago, we had them and they're pretty cool, so I decided to do it again. It's only like 10 bucks. But basically, what we ordered is there's these. Here, I can take the camera. We got these praying mantis egg sacs in there. And uh, so I think one of them at least should hatch, if not both, in the next few weeks. Uh, next one or two weeks, I think. Um, but yeah, I, I've done this before. Few years ago and it was pretty cool because i don't know like there's like a hundred of the little praying mantises that hatch out of there and yeah so it's pretty cool and well, i'll probably keep a few and then just let the rest go uh so yeah i'm looking forward to see what happens i guess but i guess i'll be back once they have hatched and i'll keep you guys updated all right, so I just ended that video and then I decided I should probably show a better shot of just what they actually look like. So that is them right there. All right, so it's a rainy day and it's been several weeks since uh, I got the Pragmantis eggs and I didn't think that they were gonna hatch because it normally does not take this long, is at least what I've read up on. But then I look over after playing some Xbox for a little bit and they've all hatched I can't get it to focus of course but all those little those are a whole bunch of little mantises I'm not sure if both hatched or just one but I'm not sure how good it would be to let a whole bunch out with it being rainy like this but I'm gonna let several or a lot of them go put a few in some cages leave a few in here and maybe let go tomorrow uh, just in case if the weather but yeah, so there we go. I'm gonna start putting them in cages while they start eating themselves each other. So yeah, since they're cannibals, kinda gotta hurry. All right, so here's a better look at some of them while I'm putting them in this cage. That's my fin pinky finger right next to them. It's like my smallest finger. And you can see how small they are. Um, and I already saw one starting to eat another one. Um, but yeah, just putting them in cages and I'll probably do updates in future videos on them getting bigger. Maybe not. We'll see. But I thought I'd do a video on uh, just all of these little mantises. So yeah, super cool. They're all brown right now, but some of them will end up being green and some brown. So that's pretty cool. It'll be interesting to see what happens. I biked a short ways to this uh, field. And we're just going to release a whole bunch of them right here. Uh, I need to... Alright. So, you can see there's just a whole bunch on there. I'm just going to shake it off. Um, and a decent amount of them should just... There's a few left in there. Still got, looks like they're coming out of both, possibly both um, eggs. Check that out. Gonna shake it off over here. And we'll grab this last one in here. Shake it off. And more are likely to come out, but I'll, so I'll probably do another releasing later, but I'll keep several of those ones. And, uh, and then also have probably have to release more once some more of them hatch. But yeah, so we're gonna head back to the house. Set up a few more cages, and uh, yeah, it should be pretty cool to see some of them grow. 
All right, so I got a few more right here. There's like probably about 30 to 40 between the lid and in there. I think it's done hatching. Uh, I'll probably release a few more and then keep some as well. But I think that's gonna be it for today's video. Um, it was a unique video, but the weather hasn't been too good. So I'll start herping up again soon once it is good enough. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd make a video because these have been my favorite insects for a long time. But thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.